Hi friends, welcome back to channel SciTaker. Finally friends, I'm back with another speed test and RAM management test comparison between the Realme GT device versus Realme GT Neo 2. And this Realme GT is something special because which has got the Realme UI 3.0 update and the Android 12 update, Android 12. Yes friends, as you can see exactly, Android 12 and the Realme UI 3.0 update. I did install this kind of early access update in this Realme uh, GT device. Let's see after this update, whether the RAM management got improved or not. So to test this kind of RAM management thing, I did install this kind of 10 mini games in both phones. So usually before the update, the phone can only store up to five games. It cannot store the sixth game in the background RAM management in the Realme phones. But let's see whether the after the Realme UI 2.0 update, did any kind of RAM management got uh, changed or not. Right now I'm trying to restart the both phones. So both phones are restarting friends and uh, so make sure to follow the playlist which I created for the Realme UI 3.0, so which will be really interesting. So this is a playlist which I created just now. Try to click on the Realme UI 3.0 features and you will be able to find all the information related to the Realme UI 3.0 in one single playlist. And overall friends, I do have like 50-50 hopes on the Realme that they will be fixing this kind of real optimization, RAM management, because even same problem with the MIUI as well. But MIUI got optimized after the MIUI enhanced update. So same thing I'm expecting after the Realme UI 3.0 update did the RAM management got fixed or not in this phone. These are the few things which I'll try to definitely concentrate in this uh, video. Right now let me try to, yes. So all the apps are completely clear from the background RAM management in both phones. Everything should be clear and external RAM capabilities also I did turn on in both phones. So perfectly done. Everything is set and uh, we are good to go between these both phones. And let's start with the first game, which is a subway surf. One, two, and three. Snapdragon 888 processor versus Snapdragon 870 chipset processor. And now we'll be able to get to know what is happening, the speed. And I did not add these games into the game space. I did not add them. So slightly the Realme GT Neo 2 was able to open. Let's see what happens with this game. Both phones did open at same time, not bad. So both are 8GB RAM variants only, exactly. It's exactly 8GB RAM variants, but, but sometimes this Temple Run game takes some time to load. So uh, sometimes, yes, that's not the phone problem. Randomly it happens like this. So not, not an issue. And next see, Crossy Roads. So I'm really curious to check friends. Snapdragon, I mean, 870 was able to open slightly faster at Realme GT Neo 2. So let's see the RAM management, how much can it be improved? So actual thing we'll be able to get to know in this one video, which will decide what is happening. In terms of the speed test, if you try to observe closely, the Realme GT Neo 2 was able to open slightly faster. Not bad in terms of the opening speeds. You can see sometimes it did open slightly faster, right? As you can clearly see what is happening. Next is the stack poles. This came also, I think, uh, yes, a little bit faster in the Realme GT Neo 2. Finally, I did open all the 10 games completely in the background. Okay, all the 10 games are open. Now let me show you the available RAM. It's of 2.24 uh, GB and 1.90 GB is available of the RAM in both phones. Now let's start testing from the back side of the, of the games. Then we'll be able to understand how many games both phones can store. Realme UI 2.0 versus Realme UI 3.0, Android 11 versus Android 12, GT versus GT Neo 2, and uh, here comes the sixth game which I'm trying to open from the multitasking, which is a Smash It game. Let's see which phone can actually store this Smash It game in the background 2.0 or 3.0. 1, 2, and 3. I think GT Neo 2 did keep the game in the background RAM management. You can see. 2.0 let's see about the seventh game so overall in the realme ui 3.0 also the ram optimization remains to be same exactly realme ui i mean gt neo 2 can keep the seven games in the background ram management seven games yes exactly seven games did keep but gt with the realme ui 3.0 it was unable to keep more than five games same problem before the update even after the update this is an early access update only but still i did not see any kind of improvement in the RAM management. So next is regarding the 8th game. Let's see this 8th game gateway to let's see 1, 2 and 3. So 8th game both phones did not keep in the background RAM management not a problem. Candy Crush also will not be there in the background RAM management. And Subway Server also not there. So overall friends 5 games and 8 games in the RAM management test. 
I did not feel any kind of huge improvement in the Realme UI 3.0 unfortunately. So this is just a beginning. So stay tuned for more updates friends. Meanwhile signing off. Thank you for watching. Bye.